Hello everyone, Saldar J here, so I tip the scales with another game of Neverwinter Nights 2, Master the Betrayer. Alright, so um, why am I in the Shadow Plane? Well, I decided that there's a bunch of uh, locked doors I need to deal with. Kaji is never going to reach the level to um, open the doors, ever. So I had to bring in, a, so I decided, well, if we're going to open these doors, might as well do it now before I get too high leveled and the battle in there becomes a little bit more trivial. I mean, the battle's probably already trivial, but, you know... It's a matter of convenience. I've brought in a, temp a temporary guest. Okay, it's temporary. As you can see, Biohazard 063, the wolf. You might know him from the Storm of the Here playthrough. Yeah, I brought him in because he's the rogue. And well, I quickly cheated into Stay items, close. gave him a lot of hit points and step. some We're powerful weapons step. to work with. He's going to disappear shortly afterwards. I say yes. He's the level 21 rogue. Now he's not leveled up, that's the way he's gonna be, le he's leveled up in the, uh, Storms of Here campaign. He's just, he's just here to, um, unlock the doors and then, you know, go back to his playthrough. Or something like that, I don't know. This is how it's going to work. Okay, so you see this heavy door? Well, Kaji can't open it. So, Bio is gonna open yes. this door. What, perhaps so. If he can reach it. If he decides he's going to reach it, so he can just do this, he unlocks the door. Open the lock. And you open that lock. Right. Okay then, well, there you go. That's Biohazard's roll all done. Let's say you get rid of him. Just hit remove, accept. Say yes. And there you go, uh... He's gone for the party. Alright, let's do this. Yeah, now I have to face ancient vampires. Great. Why did I get rid of my undead bane? Oh, and of course, I um, left that door open, so... So we faced some really powerful bad guys in there as well. Really powerful ones. Like, so powerful. Maybe I shouldn't have, maybe I shouldn't have uh, wait fired my time a little bit. But, you know, I didn't want to send Bio in and have him kill everyone. Yeah, because it'd be, it'd be unbalanced. I brought him in as a sort of a cheat mechanism. I mean, I'm cheating in this game a lot, but I brought him as a cheat mechanism. I don't want to actually use him to cheat through these battles. And trust me, I tried telling the AI not to attack something. They're dumb as a sack of hammers, and they don't, you don't want to attack something. They're, they're, they're quite fine as, elsewhere, but you don't want to attack something. You know what they're going to do? They're going to attack something. I'll discuss the contents of those chests later. Okay, because, um... A chest contains a sort of important item. Yeah. I mean, there is a way to get a better rogue in the... Like, there's another way to get a better rogue in this, um... Th thanks to the... Th thanks to the Storms of Here makeover, you can get a better rogue. No doubt about that, there is one. But... You know, don't want to spoil anything on who the rogue might be. But it's, only, but it's only added in for the uh, for this, but... Anyway, there's supposed to be a Lich King in here. Must have killed him. Yeah. Just want to get this battle all done done and dusted. And get a whole bunch of items. You might have also noticed the Broken Scythe over there. Yes. Well, Broken Scythe. Tucson Revelos. Okay, looks like we'll actually have to... Identify it again. Tucson Revelos. Okay, bring it back over here, I bring it all yes. back to me, and I'm going to cast this healing spell at the cost of a lot of my spirit energy, but eh, and yes. everyone's in the way. Yes. What do you Get want? out of the way, Oku, yes. please. What do you want? Oku, please. There you go. And, as, and of course, you get Shadows of the Void. You might know I'm showing a Shadow of the Void essence. Yeah, I kind of spawned that one in because... It's so frustrating to actually kill one of these things about, you know, it's just frustrating to kill one of these things. Watch. Eternal rest doesn't actually work. Well, it does work, but the problem is that the, um, you're very unlikely to get the eternal rest to actually, um, provide you the essence you need. So I've only spawned in one. So technically you could spawn in a whole bunch of these Shadows of the Void. Yeah. 
Um, there we go. Just wondering which key to turn the little the modes menu. Alright, and... Burn them all. Yeah, I didn't hit him because he's concealed! So if I hit meditate, doesn't mean I can get my spells back. Or I'll be out of combat for it. Ugh, come on, meditate. Now I have to recast the um, haste spell. Yes. What do you want? Haste spell recast. Excellent. And for Shadows of the Void, they have a lot of air they have a lot of fire in them. Hmm. Interesting. Interdasting. I'm gonna just, you know, cut through the battles right. here. So uh yeah. I've killed a bunch of Shadows of the Void. Didn't gain didn't get another level from it, but I did gain a lot of stuff from other things. So now it's time to head out to the next part of our journey the next quest step of our journey. Before we can involve a long waiting period. Since the resting system doesn't work. Also, these elementals, I'm not sure if they're going to remain around here dead or alive or whatever. But they're going to remain around here for a bit. So it seems, um, I can't actually... So, like, here's our next our next goal. Not the, um, Wells of LaRue over there. The destination the Sunken City. I mean, the Wells of LaRue are important, but I'd rather go to the Sunken City first. It's a matter of time saving. Okay. A little matter of time saving. I mean, huge revelations will come in here at the Sunken City, and, um... In fact, the Wells of LaRue actually could just be, um... But, you know, I have to go back to the Wells of LaRue anyway. Oh, I was afraid of this. It's daytime. It was a major Imaskari city. There may be lots of history here. Assuming the hags went pillaged and defaced everything. Just look away, reach these intact buildings off the shore. Freaks evil and rot. Rotting and corruption in the air. Isn't me. Well, could be you. City here. Perhaps fall the night shall grant us a bridge. Are you alright? You sound uneasy. One cannot go home. It's for the first time. It's a little unsettling, is it? Well, what does Caitlin have to say? Yes, how may I help? Gladly, if I have the answer. I sought to lead a crusade against the city of the dead to correct the injustice I saw there. What? <laughs> if the universe would not remove the wall of the faithless, then I would. I was not the first to feel this way. Have I told you of the first crusade? The war of Akachi against the Wall of the Faithless. He was a faithful adherent of Merkel, Lord of the Dead those many centuries ago, before the rise of Kelimbor. Jeez, they're all, they're all repeating the same thing. I mean, we've all read about this. There's the Akachi's Crusade thing. Spirit Shaman said that a whole bunch of other stuff happened. Yes, one of Merkel's chosen ones, in fact. He dispensed justice in Merkel's name and hunted the enemies of his god across the plains. But when one he loved fell victim to Merkel's laws, he appealed to his god, and was rebuked. What laws? The one who loved Akachi, she did not worship the gods, any god, let alone the god of her beloved, Merkel. There is a punishment for ones who carry such beliefs. No matter how virtuous their lives, those who do not believe in the gods will suffer upon the wall of the faithless until their souls are no more. Well, no, their souls are slanesh. Yes. Yes, it is. Once they are on the wall, they die again. And it is not a quick death. It is a slow slide. It is agony. Until their souls are dissolved into the wall. Ouch. They decay. Until they are destroyed completely. Utterly. Ouch. Akachi's sense of justice would not permit him to accept even the words of his own god if he felt they were unjust. Nor would he accept the wall that encircled Merkel City. So he gathered allies, great lieutenants of dragon kind, divas, and even the undead to his side. He attacked Merkel and was crushed. Well, of course, you're fighting against the gods. But the tale lives on. It lives on in me, in others, who saw what Akachi tried to do. And in his tale, we take strength, and we continue his war. For the Wall of the Faithless is not just. It must be cast down. Sounds like a cruel punishment indeed. I am pleased to hear you say that. Sometimes I fear that I am alone in my beliefs, and I question them. Merkel's construct has passed to Kelimvor, the new god of the dead. He is set in his ways, and is as deaf to appeals as Merkel was. There must be justice in this life, and in death. I am bound to both, but I am not bound to accept their laws. Mm-hmm. So yes, this is where you mostly gain your influence from Kaelin. 
once you got once you pass a certain point. Gladly, if I have the answer, it is yours. Yeah, as soon as you pass a certain point, you'll um be able to ask Halen some questions. Most just wandering around till I um till night time. So I'm gonna ask Pentamines for some help here. Hello, Pentamine. Well, no way, stranger. If you come to fishing, you're sorely disappointed. Are you worried about the competition? If you cast your lines in these waters, you'll not catch any fish. That's <laughs> spellcraft. <laughs> you're cloaked by an illusion, Fentamy. Your features are vague. Lock your signs are plain to one who knows magic. <laughs> An elemental basis. You're cleverer than the locals. I see. Here's a Dow. A Dow genie. Why don't you say something about it? Hmm. Okay. Influence failure. Why are you really here? Hmm. Why are you here? Fishing is good. So your fishman does not catch fish. Uh, yeah. <laughs> we already unmasked you! Is this true? <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> Farewell. Oh, okay, so... Examining... Like, so I have to come back at night, but the thing is, is that... I can't exactly camp here until the night because... Again, the sleep system doesn't work. Also, sea monster. Hmm. The sea monster, it has, um, it's impossible to fight. It's part of something big. Also, if you go here, you fight spirit rats. Oh, sorry. Elemental on this side. There's a lot of bodies around here. <laughs> Lots of bodies. Uh, don't stay there past dusk. I think even if you don't have a shadow stone, you'll be able to, um, see through things. See certain things you don't want to see. Uh, yeah, we've already... We've already established that, guys. We've already established yes. that he is not an ordinary Spike fisherman. Inside. Jeez. You'll follow me. Jeez, game. We've already established it. Not an ordinary fisherman. So I might actually just head out to the Wells of LaRue anyway. Is there are a few, like, the Wells of LaRue is actually quite a quick thing to go to. But, eh. Just kill them all. Just keep killing everyone until, until um, it reaches dusk. So you can't talk to this creature, you can't, you can't, you can't really examine it either. But apparently it's part of something big. Big and dangerous, which you never fight, and you, and hopefully you never will. It's just mostly there for flavour. Uh, come on, can I grab those remains? It's, mo it's mostly there just to set set to set a scene. Okay, Very big corpse. Ah, here we go. Telfors. Telfor. And kill those panthers. Let's see, Sun Soul. I've already got those. I've already got a set. I've already got one. Okay. Kill everything else in my path. Kill them all. Yeah. And last one. Okay, and it's still daytime. It's still daytime. So, I'm going to talk to Kaylin again. I think this is now good for influence. I am glad we have okay. time to speak. There is something I wish to share with you. A protection of sorts to aid you in our travels. Cool. You met my brother and sister in Wolfentir. Unknown to many, my siblings and I share strength as members of the Menagerie. A blessing I wish to convey upon you. Really? I am honored, Kaylin. It is a protective ward that enables focus even when one is in tremendous pain and allows one to resist wounds and ailments that assault the body so the mind can remain pure. It will aid you in the struggles ahead, perhaps even help you resist what consumes you. I thank you, Kaylin. So be it. It is done. 
Even should we part company, or I perish, the blessing will remain. Neither time nor evil shall chip at it, and it will help you until the end of your days. All right, blessing of the menagerie. Yay! Uh, blessing of the menagerie does more than that, though. It um adds wisdom. Yay! <laughs> Yay! Wisdom. If there's something I can do for you, just never mind. Anything else, Gan? And how may I honor you? Of course. Ask what you will, and I will. A little. Uh, there is uh, so much. What? Do you think? Oh, I make deals with spirit. Now, it made me strong. Indeed. Dream, Step do I spawn. look like a hag spawn? Come now. This trap. Is there something else? Alright, never mind. I'm gonna quickly cast Beguiling Influence. <laughs> see, see if that improves my, diplom my diplomatic skills. Forgot to do that And part. how may I honor you? Of course. Ask what you a little. Yeah, yeah, what? Whatever. Oh, I, I make deal. Yeah, 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 it yeah. made me. S Indeed. Green, Do I look spawn. like a hag spot? Very well. Here a we game. Go. Now that interests me. <laughs> and while I despise fairness, I must admit I am slightly curious about you. How curious? I was born. I was born in West Philadelphia. Born and raised on the town of West Harbor. I spent most of my days. Yeah. Hmm. Not as interesting as I'd hoped. Still. Very well. I was born in a city that lies beneath You're water. You're right here! <laughs> Where this city is, I do not know. Right here! I see it sometimes in my dreams, but its location eludes me. As do the faces of my mother and my father, if they existed at all. Mm -hmm. Ah, an orphan. Intriguing. Cute. I shall raise you one better. I am an orphan as well. I do not know the fate of my father, but my mother... I believe her to be the one that cast me out. An orphan. Ironic being an to give orphan. birth to me, then to feed me to the wilds of Rashomon. Not very motherly, but hags are not known for such kindnesses, I suppose. How did you survive? The animals of the world took me in. The dead shepherded the living. It mattered not to them. I learned their speech, their greetings and farewells, the cries of the wild and the whimperings of those lost. To some it is a dirge, to me, it is a symphony, and the strains are familiar ones that speak purer than any Rashemi word. So you left to wander the land. There are worse fates, and the more I spoke and bartered with the dead, the more the spirits would come to my aid. My powers grew, and so did the tales of my travels, until every farmer in this dreaming nation held a blade close to their bed, in case I should visit their daughters in the night. Oh, seriously? You just walked your dreams, though. Of course. Ask what you will. Never mind. Anything else? And how may I honor you? Nope. Okay, so you need 50 influence yes. points in order to, um, I think in order to get his yes. benefits. There you go. Hmm? See, 59 loyal just yes. on it. 46. Yes. I say so yes. I couldn't ask about Phantomy. Oh, I should have asked about Phantomy or something. I don't know. Um. Hour 17. Shouldn't be too long now. Come on. Come on, night time! Come on! I'll be right back. Alright, so, uh... Now it's now the portal's appeared. Uh, wait a second, broadcast command. Step up to the fight. I use the attack Bring command rather than the follow command to save problems. Alright, through the shadow portal we shall go into this new realm. Who will know? Boom! To the night shore. You could go that way, but there is no exit portal, so there's no point. Oh, but, okay, there, guys. Like maybe I shall level up, maybe leveling up shall be acquired. Target acquired. Oh, look at all those numbers flying. Everyone's dying. Who knows what else might be lying. But he's got to be trying. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Okay. There we go. More stuff to loot. Lots of essence. And I collect more um, essence than that Zerg guy. And he's all about essence. I made that one before, haven't I? Yep. Hope that's all the um, essence in the area for that, for that, for that section. Moving on to the next area. I think some bad guys spawn around here. 
Oh, that's right, there are beached corpses. There are beached corpses here. But as soon as I approach, soul saw a rat appear. Like and I got a short sword plus four from it. And I get pissed by the annoying Telthor rats, which, you know, they're just so numerous and so annoying. Yeah, alright, come on. Now we go to the beach corpse. Wait, if I, can I hand this off to you now? Come this way. Can you learn it? No, you can't. It's not a um, wizard spell. Oh, that's right. I don't think you can actually learn it. It's not part of your, um... I think, I think it was, um, taken away from you. When you became a red wizard, you can't summon things. You can transmute things, you can transmute souls and stuff, because that's what your speciality is, but I don't think you can actually, um... Yeah, I don't think Sophia can actually... Um, summon things. Oh. I'm trying to avoid you. <laughs> Who are you? Ah, that's right, the fisherman. Yeah, I love picking things from the water to the ground. It's all fixing the on a plane of water. I'm listening. It runs large gem mining in the Great Dismal Dell, but I dare that Yellow's reduced to sabotage one of the rivals. A heavy lifter. Great power, but easily controllable. You seek a slave. I do not tolerate slavery. Yeah, that's right, nor do I. I should liberate your head from your shoulders. Oh, yeah! Slavery is a tasteful descriptor, and not approved in this case. Is the weapon you, you wield a slave to you? It's an inanimate ob- uh, no. What the oxen that hold the materials to create the weapon? And it was a feeling too. Alright, consider the gold that stand over the tower of a wizard. Who created your weapon? Are they slaves? Can't condone the use of golems. He's looking for another golem. Yeah. So, what do you need me to do? You need to vanquish it, and it will return to the element of plane of Earth. Hmm. Why don't you do it yourself? Well. Terrifier clunking close by. He's, he hates water. Is it beneath this place? The sky, is it? Farewell. Yeah, I don't want to, um... That's the easy way out. If you want to, um... Like, there are two solutions to this, um... To that problem there. There are two solutions. There is either the, um... Oh! Hey! You came to me! He's in the coffin? Alright, fine. Whatever. Farewell. See you later. Can I get back to combat? You... Dude. You interrupted my combat. Okay, I wasn't even going near Count Crow Roost. By the way, is in that coffin over there. But as you can see, um, yes, summon Kaji. Now, there's a thing you can do is um, he's he's apparently waiting in line for something. It's secure. Yeah, let's fling it through the portal. Oh, get away! Oh right, if it's daylight on the other side, then it doesn't matter. But, I could probably pick it up later or something. Yeah, that's what I'm going to do. Enter through the portal before it uh, becomes further into the darkness. Because I won't have to wait again. Don't want to wait for you. I'll wait for you. Okay, now the beach corpse here. Take all that. Okay. So all the stuff I'm just going to sell off. And conveniently, there's a merchant up ahead. Oh, look! It's Merrick, the Lich! Hello, Merrick! It's you again! You are surprised to see me! I am not! I use my great power as an evocation to produce a solution to seeing the coven! And you arrive! Wait, evocation? Isn't that where you throw fireballs? Wait! Wait a second! You're not a real wizard! You're not from North Kilt Town! <laughs> Why do you want to see the coven? Okay, the Emiskari, he recovers the relics, alright. Also... Alright. Come along then. 
Oh, never mind. Who cares? Oh. Jeez. Well then, uh, that was, um... Okay, never mind. I should kill him. <laughs> Not like I wanted him anyway. I hate that guy. Just curious. Yeah, I could just, you know... There's two ways you'll count crow roost. You can throw him out the portal and, um... Which I'll do because... You gain influence if you talk to Oku about it. Yeah, just throw him through the portal. Which, in fact, I'm now going to open up. Kaji seems like it. What have you done? Who deserves my rest? Now let's kill him. I want to level it up. <laughs> Experience points granted for disturbing a vampire's rest. <laughs> some of this just... Some of this... Classic. You can't use vampiric feast on a vampire. Well, you can, but... That'd be ironic. And I got his kukri. Stay here for the moment, because I want to grab the gold from his servant. Now let's enter the portal. Let's get back out here. So yes, the idea is you can't really petition your way through, like... What you got to do is you've got to petition your way through to get into a certain location. So, um... Yeah. But what you can just do is kill everyone. <laughs> it's you again, yada yada yada. I'm here to see the coven. No, I don't need your help. Oh, yes. <laughs> For a moment, I thought you might allow him to join the company. Time is an endless commodity. Yes, how may nope, I help? Nothing else for you? Yes. He's devoted. Yes. Quick. Hmm. Here we go. Little one. I was hoping to speak to you for a moment. Cool. You seem to be in a pleasant mood. Yes, little one. I have been enjoying our travels together. Sleeping in my barrow. I have forgotten the joy of wanderlust and the thrill of combat. You've given me the chance to remember. More importantly, you've shown me that you are genuinely striving to end the hunger within you. Cool. Um... <laughs> of course, my life depends At on it. At first, I was concerned that you would revel in the ability to destroy Many spirit eaters have done just that, given in to the hunger and embraced it. But you've been defiant of the wrath within you. I no longer have doubts about my oath to help you. I have a gift for you, little one. A token of friendship. Aww, that's magic. Um... Have you seen my friend? I don't need any gifts. Nonsense. <laughs> It is of little effort for me to give, and you have earned it. My confidence in you, in my oath, has empowered my will. I feel fearless and without concern. I want to share with you some of the strength you've given me. Alright. Thank you, Oku. I am here to help you, to protect you. By making you stronger, I do more to keep you safe than I ever could with tooth and claw. Can I get a blessing? Yay! Cool. So um, now I get this. Um, now I get the devotion of the Bear King. Or yeah, he's. I think this is the top. This is the top ranking. Twenty percent bonus to suppress. Plus four will saves. Immunity to fear. Plus two constitution. So yeah, that is a. Uh, Enormous blessing. Emma, what do you want? <laughs> the weak gear I'm wearing. Are you calling me stupid? So, you're a merchant. <laughs> you even, even buy the trash I've got. Yeah, I'm pretty sure my gear is trash. Yeah, but anyway, I'm just going to quickly check this one. <gasps> yes! Plus four enchantment! For armor. Oh. But there's nothing for weapons. Damn. But yes, plus four armor enchantment. Woohoo! That's uh, more than that's greater than you think. It's more likely than you think. But anyway, I think that'll be for another time though, because I'm gonna Can it be the scent of my spirit kin in this foul place. 
because now I'm going to be taking on the Slumbering Coven or whatever. I've been Stars RJ and I've tipped the scales in the favour of, um, Rashomon. <laughs> Signing off. I like that. <laughs>